First, the details from a city audit show San Diego has spent hundreds of millions of dollars in liability costs. ABC 10 News reporter Marie Cornell has more on the recommendations that have been made to cut back on these issues. The interim city auditor presented the findings of a report that outlines what the city can do to cut back on liability costs. Public liabilities are a major risk the city faces. In a presentation to the city council's budget committee, the city auditor's office presented this data showing from 2010 to 2018, the city had 20,000 public liability claims, which has resulted in $220 million in public liability costs, which translates to about $25 million a year to settle or resolve these claims. At the top of that list, as far as the number of cases, involves city vehicle accidents with 2,075 claims, where the city paid $38.7 million. Also included in this list, trips and falls with 931 claims, and the city paid $14.7 million towards those liability costs. The city auditor's office also made recommendations to reduce the number of claims. When it comes to trips and falls, they suggest that the city focus on fixing the sidewalks in high pedestrian areas. Their data has found people are four times as likely to trip and fall in those areas because of damage to the sidewalks. When it comes to accidents involving city drivers, they believe there needs to be more training for city drivers. We found that these data-driven remedial trainings appear to be effective at reducing the incidence of drivers involved in multiple accidents. And while that's a good thing, the ultimate goal should be to prevent such accidents in the first place, which necessitates providing proactive vehicle trains to all city drivers. The report will now be forwarded over to the city council so they can review it and the recommendations included. From the Embarcadero, Marie Cornell, ABC 10 News.